You have a reputation of being a very much a visionary, ideological leader. Your hallmark of, is that you are a great collaborator. So tell me a little bit about the relationship that you have with your management team. I have observed them to be more your partners rather than your subordinates. What, what's the culture do you, that you create and, and how do you foster the environment of collaboration and partnership? I think one of the things that's been really extraordinary is the team in their own maturity has come to recognize the strengths of each other. So we recognize that when we're working together to solve a problem, that the perspectives that they each bring make that solution so much better. And we do that very differently, and I think we've worked really hard to understand each other's styles, points of warning and points of excitement, and you know, this person's really passionate about this, and whether that comes with positive, negative, passion, you know, the team is very respectful and very supportive, and I'd say, that's the most extraordinary part. And I feel really fortunate, as I think they do, that there's such a strong sentiment of being proud of the culture, proud of the collaboration, and respectful of each other's differences. And we are very, very different individuals in terms of like mm -hmm. how we show up, right? I mean, the analytic, right? The communicator, the over-communicator, the emotive, the not very emotive. It's quite delightful to be able to celebrate that diversity in problem solving. So I feel really lucky. I think it's one of the best parts of my job actually is the team that I work with. And with that healthy team dynamics, it cascades towards the rest of the organization. You mentioned culture. How would you describe the culture of OMD right now? You know, it's a funny time to be having this conversation and then you wonder how that experience is going to unfold for your staff because the part of the interpersonal, the I see you, you see me, how does that work every day, we, we've lost a little bit of the physical dynamic that we the had intimacy. together, the intimacy that we had together and it's, it's okay electronically but it's not quite the same. And what has been extraordinary is we've checked in with staff over the course of the summer and as the dynamic is changing and the world is becoming more complex and more frightening is that people are actually even more grateful for the support they have at work and the support they have from each other and in fact as we've measured culture and engagement and participation our staff have responded with we appreciate the transparency we appreciate the opportunity we appreciate the flexibility we appreciate not having to worry about our jobs and i feel grateful that i'm able to be a part of an environment that that's actually what we can offer people, that that's not kind of what's happening. So the culture message we often live is, you know, participate in the environment that you want, right? Like if, if you want something to be different, then you have something to say about what that difference needs to be. Not only doing that with my management team, but the management team beneath them and the staff is so important. It's like, you've got something to say, then you need to, to say it. If you want to make a contribution, we welcome it and I think that really helps people feel connected and that's really been a great part of what we've been able to accomplish this year. The OMD magic. OMD magic.